Okay, yeah, I hear you. All right. Breaking news, this just in. The man named Jesus that we've been hearing all about has shown up here in Galilee. It's said that he teaches, he preaches, he heals and delivers anybody who comes to him. His fame is all throughout Syria. We've got people from Galilee, Decapolis, Jerusalem, Judea, and far beyond Jordan. There's so many people following him, he had to climb up the mountain to teach the people. We'll call this the Sermon on the Mount. It seems as if Jesus is uplifting and the current followers and teaching the newly converted Christians how they should live. So many topics have been covered, sin, anger, retaliation, divorce, enemies, prayer, fasting, you name it, he's covering it. That's just a few of the topics. The people are glued to Jesus. Look at this, they're astonished at his art of teaching. He teaches with such authority that he captivates the crowd. I mean, he's full of wisdom. He does mighty works through his hands, so I've heard. After a teaching like this, people should forever be changed. Jesus' words set the tone for almost every area of life. If you've been following Christ for years or are newly converted, you now have all the tools you need to live a righteous life. Let's take a listen to what Jesus is saying now. Everyone who hears these words of mine and puts them into practice is like a wise man who built his house on the rock. The rain came down, the streams rose, and the winds blew and beat against that house, yet it did not fall because it had its foundation on the rock. But everyone who hears these words of mine and does not put them into practice is like a foolish man who built his house on sand. The rain came down, the streams rose, and the winds blew and beat against that house, and it fell with a great crack. Well, folks, who will you be? A wise man or a fool? After Jesus leaves today, some people will take what he said and live a Christ-like life. And some will be like the Pharisees and the Sadducees, talking the talk, but not walking the walk. Back to you, Bartholomew.